Hello everyone, welcome to Coding Asylum. Let's see how do we censor all the bad or curse words using Python program. Okay, so all we need to do for it is download a simple Python module. So open up your terminal and type the command pip install better underscore profanity. So yes, better profanity is the name of the module that we are going to use in this video. Uh, what this module does is it uh, censors all the uh, bad or curse words uh, from a string or from any file or from anywhere you need to. Okay, once you download it, come back to your IDE or code editor and import this module from better profanity. We'll be importing profanity here, okay? And then we'll type a text string, okay? so. Let me type a uh, sentence having a bad word in it. So, uh, okay. So I typed it, and now we are going to censor this text. So let's see how to do it. Censor text. I'm creating a variable named censor text, and we are going to censor it. How we are going to that? We'll do profanity dot censor. So, and this will take the argument of the text. Okay. So text is the name of the variable that we are using and now we will print this censored text okay so let's run the program here and see what's the output so we got you piece of with four asterisks in here okay by default profanity replaces each swear word with four asterisks okay so it's by default Sensor doesn't care about word dividers. Okay, this uh, sensor function, uh, this doesn't care about word dividers. So uh, even if there was no space in between the words, uh, it, it uh, might have that uh, there are some other characters like commas or anything else in here. Okay, so it doesn't care about. It will simply do its task as it is programmed. Okay, let's run this program out and see what's the output. We got the same output again that... Uh, with uh, this four asterisks in place of the curse word here, okay. And uh, this is a pretty smart uh, uh, module that uh, even if we write uh, such curse word uh, in some code words like uh, instead of writing the correct spelling, we sometimes write F C U K. So what it will do? It can also uh, know that uh, it will know that it is also a bad word written in somewhat different style let's run this program and you can see it uh, replaced uh, this uh, word with four asterisks here so it's a pretty smart module sometimes we need to use some custom characters here okay so uh, with custom characters what do i mean is in place of these four asterisks you would want to use some other symbols here like uh, do like the dollar symbol or pound symbol or anything so for that what we'll need to do is just we'll be adding a comma here and after adding this uh, comma we'll adding we'll add the character that we need to suppose i need to see some dashes in place of that uh, uh, curse word so that i just placed a dash here and running this program and just it gave me u p dashes with four dashes if i type here uh, underscore it will give me underscore if i type any number it will give me that or anything okay now what if we need to check if the string contains any swear word so for that what we will need to do is uh, just we just let me just erase these all things and uh, cheer uh, dirty text this is a it will be a dirty string okay so we're right here okay so profanity so we are in need to check that this is uh, this string contains any bad or swear words in it just we need to know we do not need to censor it so for that uh, we need the output to be either true or false so what we'll be doing here is that profanity dot contains profanity contains profanity and give here the name of that string in here it is dirty text okay and print it out using the print function and running this program will give me the value it is giving true as there is uh, uh, this uh, bad words here uh, one of them is this and the another is this one let's see if it considers this uh, second cursor to be 
a curse word or not. Uh, let me erase this uh, first word. Okay, and uh, rerun this program. In this case, it is also giving true means it is also considering this word as a curse word. Okay, let me erase it and write another string in here. I love you and run this program out and now it is giving the value to be false that uh, no dirty text is inserted in here means that no bad or swear words are there. Okay, I love you is a sweet text to be said to your soulmate. Okay, so censor swear words with the custom word list. We can also that uh, we can uh, like uh, it may also happen that to uh, we hate someone, uh, we hate some other words, okay, the, those words, uh, the words that are not bad, but we just hate them for some personal reasons or like anything, okay, uh, so we can add those words into the list of bad words, so how do we do that, let's see, so we can add some custom bad words, so let, let us create a list in here named custom bad words. And in custom bad words, I will be adding some uh, words like uh, TikTok. Okay, TikTok is a bad word. Adding in here again, Trump. <laughs> Trump is a bad word. And words like handsome that some people, some boys use such words. I don't really like when some male people use such words to describe themselves. Okay, so let us use uh, these words as bad words. So how do we add these words uh, to the list of uh, bad words that this module contains? Okay, so for that what we need to do is profanity dot load censor words and add this uh, list. Okay, in here uh, write custom bad words, custom bad words, and then no, we'll press profanity dot sensor let's sensor a string uh, like uh, Trump was the former president or the former president of USA Le and uh, print this statement out let's so print this running this program it replaced the uh, word uh, Trump, the name Trump, with four asterisks in here. Let's add uh, another character instead of asterisks. So for that, we can use the symbol of hashtag. Okay, rerun the program and it replaced it with four hashtags. Okay, we can also give the word list as a file, like if you store the uh, list of words in any text file or something, what we need to do is uh, there is another uh, function in here instead of load sensor words uh, you will be need to do profanity dot load sensor words from file and in here give the location of the file that you need to use okay I'm not going uh, in such deep uh, right now okay so let's remove this out then there might be some words that are included in the list of bad words according to this uh, module but uh, you might uh, want that uh, those words are not as bad as you think and that's why you need to remove them from that list okay you need to you, you want to use those words so for that what you will need to do is use whitelist words okay whitelist so for how will you use whitelist uh, let's see how profanity Custom bad let's erase all this. We'll what we'll do is profanity dot uh, load sensor words uh, load sensor words and write here whitelist words equals and give here the words that you don't want to be in the list of bad words like uh, uh, any word that you don't want to like uh, this word okay itself okay so load the words and then using this word will not censor it out like profanity dot sensor uh, a bad word let's print it let's see if it works or not and running this program and this time it didn't uh, 
put uh, it didn't replace the word with uh, four asterisks because we whitelisted the, this word as uh, to be not a bad word okay so you can also add some more bad words in the dictionary in the list of bad words uh, uh, given in the this uh, module okay if you want to like uh, what you'll need to do is again create any uh, list custom bad words or anything that you want custom bad words and here add the words that you need to add to the list of bad words here okay like uh, anything to be angry let angry be a bad word angry obese let obese be one or and then this uh, underweight let these words to be bad words now what we need to do is we will be adding such words into the list of bad words provided in this module so for that we will be doing profanity dot add sensor words and in add system uh, sorry uh, add sensor words we will give this input custom bad words okay now what it will do is it will add this uh, list into the list of bad words that the module already having that the module is already having okay now what we are doing is we'll see does it censor the words or not profanity dot censor and write in here that uh, underweight people's underweight uh, contestants are not allowed contestants are not allowed Suppose there is any competition going on where underweight contestants aren't allowed. Okay, so let's print it out and re let's run this program and see it replaced it with four asterisks. Again, the word underweight was replaced with four asterisks. The same will be done if we put obese there. First of all, let's put this weight, okay, to make sure that it is not uh, uh, adding all the words that are placed in this position so see it didn't replace this word weight with four asterisks but uh, in place of weight if i type obese it will do okay so it did so guys that was all the basics of this video if you liked it if you learn from this video if i didn't waste your time in this video please do like it share it and subscribe my channel coding asylum thank you for watching this video we'll meet you next time